what's up guys welcome back to our channel if you're new here make sure to hit the subscribe button down below this is part two of our delivery vlog and I just want to let you guys know we worked Father's Day and I worked Mother's Day by myself. I made about $250 on Mother's Day working six hours. We worked together on Father's Day about six hours. We made $200. You want to work special occasions because they actually end up being more money because it's busier. People are at home. They're not cooking. All that good stuff. They're in a better mood. Sometimes they tip you well. We are on another delivery run for the day. We just started. It's about 5.10 and we hope to work another four hours. We're gonna take you guys for the ride. Here's it's up. What's up guys, how's it going? We're driving and he was sweet enough to bring us a snack. That's the number one way to save money. Bring your own snacks everywhere. Here's our first delivery and we're on our way. Another delivery, here we go. Another day, another dollar. Another day, another delivery. And hopefully another dollar if there's a tip. We definitely have to hustle. And we definitely have to hurry up to get these deliveries delivered. Alright guys, so this is the moment of truth. And also my favorite moment is the moment where Zay comes back to the car and I ask her if they tipped and how much. So let's see if they tipped and let's see how much. How much did they tip? Five dollars. We got another set of orders. Three dollars. Three isn't too bad. To be honest. Our last cash delivery, the guy gave us a $12 tip. That's awesome. So we just got home from delivering. It's Tuesday night. We already counted the money off camera and we have a profit of $110 tonight. We average about $100 a night depending on what day it is. Sometimes the weekdays are a little bit more slow than the weekends, and it averages about to $100 a night. So if you're working five, six nights a week, that's five or $600 a week extra you're making. What was that? <laughs> We're done with this cringiness. Let's go. <laughs> you ready? They're kind of cold. We're currently in the process obviously of packing our little snack for our deliveries because you get hungry delivering and you don't want to be stopping and drive through because it's not good for your health and it's really not good for your wallet either all right what's up guys it's day two of deliveries it's 5 15 or 5 16 right now it's actually 5 10 the clock is wrong in this car of course <laughs> and uh, we're about to start delivering we're waiting on three deliveries right now and uh, we'll bring you guys with us again it's a wednesday by the way <laughs> all right guys so we're just pulling up to our very first order right now and Zay's about to click it in so let's see if we get a tip first order let's see if we get a tip you guys already know how excited i am What's five. up? A five whole dollars? Five dollars. That's Plus amazing. Four dollar delivery fee? That's a nine dollar order. So average about nine to ten dollars an order. It's not too bad. Yeah, we got a ton of ten dollar or I mean five dollar tips yesterday too. So hopefully today's the same. Hey guys, so I feel like in our last vlog I didn't explain exactly how this all works. And I just wanted to let you guys know that my dad does charge a 75 cent fee per delivery that he does send the driver to. So that's how he makes his income. And when you go to really close deliveries near the restaurant, that's probably your best profit because you're not wasting a lot of gas and it's super close. You're going to get the order done quick and you're not wasting time. Also, my, my car is really good on gas. It's four cylinder. It's a Honda Civic 2009. It only costs me about 40 to $60 a tank 
on like the lowest pricing gas or when it's really high I don't pay more than $60 so and I fill up about once a week if it's a really busy week and I'm working a lot and I'm working long hours I'll fill up twice a week but that's rare and that's a good amount that he's spending on gas if you're making about an average of $100 a day that's $600 a week if you're working six days a week as you guys can see there's only a little bit more gas left one bar so we're gonna go to the gas station right now and uh, we'll fill up and we'll show you guys exactly how much it costs for a fill up so anyways guys that's how much it costs right there to fill up the car Full on gas again, thank goodness. And it only cost about $42 as you guys can see, so it's not too bad. So you don't get tipped every time. Like for example, this time we didn't get a tip, but the delivery charge was $8. So that's still worth it. So guys, we're definitely not mad when we don't get tips. It's obviously nice to get the tips, but we do understand that not everyone can afford to tip, but it is exciting when we do get the tips. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching our video. Our next video coming up on Monday will be a Q&A video. Make sure you guys drop your comments and questions down below, and we'll make sure to feature you and answer all your questions. Please, please, please.